Hi, I'm Forging of Friends, and welcome back for another episode of uh, Car Mechanics. And uh, by far, this is the worst car I have ever gotten. By far. Okay? So, let's have a look at this. So, the caller says, oh, find and fix any running gear problems. Gear problems. It does have the suspension on it. So, I instantly went, oh, it must be, you know, uh... You know, gearbox, engine maybe problems, um, you know, sort of weird stuff maybe in the in the back axle. Yep. So I've stripped the whole entire engine, taken out all the, you know, pistons, everything, all the suspension, all the tires, all the axles, all the, you know, thingy, all the rear suspension, everything else. And it literally turned out it was that one rubber bush right there. I don't get how that's a running gear problem. That'd be a suspension problem. So I've literally now got to put the whole entire car back together. Cause I, stripped it. I originally thought, oh, maybe because this is a new DLC, there might be like, you know, gear shift stuff. Like inside the car? Nope, not that. So literally you gotta put this whole entire car back together from stripping it from bare bones. What a waste of my time. Well, now you know. What a joke. I've had this car just sitting here for like quite a while as, as I did other cars and I've been like going back to it periodically just to like try and figure out what the hell is wrong with this car. I took the fuel off, everything just, yeah, I completely stripped it. As you're about to see, I'm going to leave this whole entire put back thing together because that was a joke. At least I know now. If it just says suspension, it's just take everything off the suspension. Because look, you can see I could. I was like, th this is the part where I was like, oh, maybe it is suspension. So I came to the suspension. You know, after removing the gearbox, the fuel. Uh, removing all the oil, removing all the water. It was literally just one, one rubber bush for all this effort. I was getting tempted just to get the car back. I was gonna be like, nope, I've had enough. <laughs> I can't find the problem. It's literally just one rubber bush. What an absolute joke. Right, okay, so we're just reattaching the whole entire suspension right now. I got to do an electric vehicle, I've been slowly sort of upgrading um, my stuff. I've got a, a battery charger now. I don't care what I'm putting on it, I could put worse or items on it, I just want to get this car out of my garage I had so, I'm just so sick of it I still gotta put the whole entire engine together so I, I completely stripped the engine I thought it was an engine problem and then I was like oh maybe it's the um, you know the fuse box that one time when I got confused about you know there was a single 
uh, fuse box uh, thing that was out. Uh, are the same size? Yep. Yeah. yeah, it was like an electrical fault, and I searched all over the car trying to find it. I put the, you know, the um, the scanner on it, and I thought the scanner would check the 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 fuse box. I'm pretty sure it does in real life. It will tell you if a fuse is out. Right, is that the, the back together now? Right, that's the rear fixed. Tire rods. Right, let's not completely waste my 56. I'm not going to waste my new products on it. Just so many rubber bushings. Tire rod. Nope. Cancel that. I probably got one that's What on a massive annoyance. Yeah, so making these you'll have to let me know how you wanna see these videos if it's people something that people are interested in because it is very re repetitive um, doing this. Obviously, you're going to get the, the nice cars later on and the electric cars and stuff like that. Um, but it's more or less if people want to see it. Tire out to this side. I can't believe I've done all that and it was just the, the single rubber bush. I'm just going to constantly complain about it now. Out the tire rod. Uh, no. At least you can see a full car basically put together. Suspension. Uh, probably missing the wheel hub bearing. Cap. Oil filter. We shall go underneath. See what I mean? I pulled out all these little nooks and crannies of this. Oh, oh at least I'm getting up in the money, so can't really um there you go that one on charge part mount battery Fuel filter. Now all the pistons. Uh, 
<laughs> you see what I mean? I had to do all this to try and find that one rubber bush. Because I, I literally just couldn't find it. Can you imagine if you were like the customer of this car, you'd be like, <laughs> you know, trying to explain to them why you've just stripped the whole entire car apart. I'm like, well, you told me it was a running gear problem. So I took out your gearbox. If someone said to me, running gear, but re running uh, gear problem, it sounds gearbox related does not sound suspension related. I, should, I took out all the oil so it's like it's probably going to cost me more in oil than it did for that rubber bushing that I Yeah, now you know my pain of what I've had to go through. <laughs> Obviously taking off all this. I don't even I don't think um test driving it either would have brought shown me the problem because I did the inspection. Um, I'll show you that in a second. Right, that's most of that. Then we need spark plugs. At least he's getting all brand new bolts for his car. And an oil change. And a power steering change. And a water change. And probably some new parts that he didn't really need. I never want to do this again. If I ever, if I ever see a, you know, this car or this subject turn up again, I'm just gonna yeet them straight out the door. Okay, and. Two more. Then we still got the covers to go. Oh, okay. Come on. We're almost at the finish line. I still gotta attach all the exhaust pipes as well. So the ignition. Let's cover.
Know my pain. Just listening to that rat shit. I have to listen to this. Trying to figure out where the hell it was. <laughs> I did get an electric car in. Just before this one. And that was a pain. There was literally like... You had to take... There was one single part in the center of the engine that needed to come out. Everything around it was perfectly fine. <laughs> Just bar one bit of the engine. And if that's how electric cars are in real life, I do never want to like touch one. Oh, so we got flywheel. What else needs to be put in on top before I zoom back to the bottom? Okay, so back up. We'll just go back outside because I think I've got some cars still waiting. Yeah. Okay. So, underneath. At least, like, people can go along with my suffering of this. I've never done this to an extent in real life, but I've taken a gearbox apart and put it back together. And that was, yeah, that's interesting. I can literally just see the finish go, come on. I still gotta get put the gear box on, you know, the thing that you would un think was, you know, gear related. So that's all of that. Um, uh, flower wheel. I was like, what am I looking for? Clutch plate. Clutch pressure pipe. Clutch release plate. Gearbox. Down again. What's wrong with you? Uh, running gear control repair of the tasks. Refill brake fluid. Okay. Starter motor, everything looks in. Except for obviously the starter motor, but. Uh, so it's gonna get new oil, <laughs> new. Um, what 
Yeah, I don't know how much that costs me. Where's the dipstick? Yeah, good enough. How much is this gonna cost me? 14 quid. Right, let's just check something. Fifteen. So I've already spent more in the uh, refilling of everything. What a waste! Okay, and now I need to go back up. Put the starter on. was a power steering. It was the brake thing they wanted, it, wasn't it? Refill brake fluid, yeah. Didn't need to do that. I guess it, I don't know if it'll come out of the the pocket because I had to find the bloody thing. Uh, okay, uh, is that yeah? Get out of my shop. That was such a pain. <laughs> Jesus. Right. Um. Oh. Go outside. You. Other left. Drags me back inside. Perfect. It was this back tire, wasn't it? Brake fluid, brake fluid steering. Okay, that's uh, just all under the hood. There we go. Put it back on. I should have a spare one. No, I don't. Small. A little bite. Ten. Because you know you'll never need them. This one, get me a little one now. I was staring and what's up? I 
I wonder if I'd, I didn't have to take it actually out. I didn't think of that. Ah, oh, well. I'll answer that question. Yep. Oh, okay. Problem with you. Uh, change brake fluid, coolant. Ah, so I can do that in the parking lot. Drain everything. Easy day. Good. Good. As soon as it dips. On. We'll take so they're just sitting ready. That one should appear right here in front of me, and then I was going to say, if it's the same, fuck, <laughs> did I mess it up? Okay, so next episode is going to be doing this full one. Uh, I got quite a lot of money, so I should be able to do it from start to beginning. So if you leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye-bye.